$941 in Canadian Tire money. It took Thomas Turfloth three years to save, but he finally has enough to cash in for a brand new canoe. Turfloth says the goal started as a joke on social media, but once his friends and family heard about it, they all began donating to his cause. So did complete strangers. Uh, for some reason that I don't really understand, it just kind of like resonated with people. Like it, it wasn't just that they liked it, or they thought it was funny, but they wanted to like contribute. And I was like, I got letters in the mail from people I didn't know with a note that would say, hey, I'm friends with so-and-so and I heard about your idea and I wanted to help out and there'd be like 80 cents in there, you know, like, so people wanted to participate. If you shop at Canadian Tire, you'll probably remember being handed back some of these bills at the checkout. They've been floating around in wallets and drawers since 1958. The company has now switched over to a card program, but will still give you bills if you aren't signed up. But collecting a briefcase full of 5 and 10 cent notes takes a while. Turfoth reached his goal this month when he turned 40. His friend surprised him with $500 in Canadian tire money. When he walked up to buy his canoe with it, the cashier's jaw dropped. I was not expecting that at all. <laughs> yeah, I pressed the wrong button on the on the till and everything because I've just never seen that. <laughs> I don't know if I can think of anything more Canadian. It's very, I don't know, it's like really hoser. <laughs> but I'm not dating myself too much. But yeah, it's like, I feel like the guys from FUBAR are going to show up or something. You know, it's like really, it's a, I don't know if it could happen anywhere else. Turfoth was all smiles after buying his canoe and even has $150 in Canadian tire money left. He says he plans to spend it on a cover for his new canoe. Alex Saladuka, CBC News, Regina.